YouTube channel if you have not yet subscribed please do subscribe yeah? so guys on this video I'm gonna be showing you how you can uh, find answers very fast when you are writing a multiple choice uh, it might be an exam it might be a test it might be an assignment you know? so I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can yeah, find those answers very fast you know? um, my PC does not allow me to use a microphone so I don't know whether the quality of this audio will be sufficient or what ne? but i'll try my best to be loud ne? so let's get to it so guys um my pc does not allow me to use microphone uh, when i'm using this mode ne? i don't know why but i i do believe that this thing does not affect my audio quality ne? so i'll try to be loud as i can so guys so for this thing before we start ne, there are some certain rules that i should tell you about ne? so guys for this thing to work you need to study you need to read your books you need to study and understand the content of the 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 things that are there in your study material because if you don't understand you will not uh, be familiar with the things that are there so whenever you are looking for a question you might even end up spending five minutes on each question and then it's going to be time consuming and then you will not be able to manage your time very well so you need to start guys study hard that i do believe that yeah there are some certain things maybe that would make that will not make sense in there but uh, focus on those that make sense and stuff like that i do believe that 90 percent of the things that they there in your study material you will understand only 30 percent which is going to be left out but uh yeah it's going to be left I mean to say it's going to be left but uh you will manage to recover it as long as you are familiar with the module good name and i chapter 7 talks about ubuntu and stuff like that chapter what talks about neutral percent law, things like that you know and then the other thing is that you need to practice guys you need to have a study group you need to have a study group so this is how you do a study group study group doesn't mean that you have to be like uh, visiting people and stuff like that eh? there's too much human trafficking in south africa so to be on the safe side guys please create some whatsapp groups because of this nowadays you can see that telegram eh, things that are happening on telegram i don't understand because telegram was created for educational purposes but like for those groups they were created for educational purposes but whenever we are discussing some certain things we are being kicked out we like we don't know whenever you are helping someone they kick you out Whenever someone is asking a question, they kick that person out. So most of us, we, we have been kicked out. So yeah, normalize joining WhatsApp groups. And then uh, please guys, in some certain groups, in there, you might find out that people are not discussing. If people are not discussing, create another group. Create a group for yourself. Check people who are participating in that group and then go straight into their inbox. Introduce yourself. Tell them that you know what uh, I have seen that you you are participating in that group. So I wanted to create a what well, that group which has that thing, you know, so that we can discuss and learn and help each other with what what we are. So maybe if you guys could be at least five going up, ah, everything's going to go well. Everything's going to go well. Just but keep it professional, guys. Please make sure that you keep it professional. No mujolo jolo live it ne. Make sure that you keep it professional, you respect each other and stuff like that. Ne? And then yeah, everything will be partial. The other thing is that you need to use previous question papers. Guys, you need to make sure that you have previous question papers. Before you write an exam, you do previous question papers. Make sure, make sure, make sure, make sure. Make sure discuss them with your friends. And then you can even use this thing that I'm going to be showing you now. Ne? Then yeah, after that you will make sure that you after that you will make sure that you benefit from this thing and then the other thing guys is that you might be able to find memorandums once you find a memorandum don't focus on the memorandum don't check the memorandum avoid the memorandum do the question alone and then afterwards then you will check the memorandum which oh where did i go wrong and stuff like that ne? so if you don't have previous question papers go to telegram join a group on telegram and then yeah it's going to be like this let me just open one module which is in and then i go to my options then from the group info then from the files and stuff like that then here you just press exam 
can just press exam then all the exam question papers are going to appear which were sent in this thing and then i do believe that also those things those exam packs are going to appear in it then you download everything then yeah you, you have you don't wait for the lecture to pull to post those question papers because of they might take time and when you are on a tight schedule now so for myself i managed to download a study guide for cpd 1501 and then the question paper for 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 this thing cpd 1501 it was written in 2020 uh, for semester one i like it on my study guide is on the left side okay there yeah, everything is perfect né? so here we have to start né? so yeah guys you can see that is 100 marks each mark each question is going to consist of two marks so yeah you we have 50 multiple choice questions né? so what i used to do i used to say that 120 120 is two hours and an hour has 60 minutes so 60 plus 60 is equals to 120 so i used to say 120 divided by 50 is going to be 2 point something 2 comma something 2 comma something i don't have a calculator but i'm 100 percent sure that it's going to be 2 comma something now i'm teaching you measurement spaceship and measurement so yeah that first digit those first digits are minutes and then the things after that thing of dot yeah, they are seconds in it so we don't focus much on seconds and i i focus too much on minutes so which means which means that that two is two minutes so on each question you should spend or you should use only two minutes not more you should not exceed two minutes so that you may be on like on time or to be able to to write that thing so that i was distracted a bit so to write that thing so that you can be able to finish on time and answer all those questions and provide uh, perfect answers and stuff like that so let's start so question one guys you see number one so guys what you have to do now you have to look for a keyword the keyword can come from the question the keyword can come from the options which you are given to choose and stuff like that so you take the keyword you go straight to the study guide you search the word in the study guide and then the study guide is going to the, then your device is going to scan everything in that thing so if it matches it's going to show you good normal we have found this certain results so yeah you can go and check let me show you how you do it né? for example my keyword is going to be extraditional né? and then they say that extradition can be defined as then i go to my study guides then guys there's this glass even if you're using a phone or a tablet there's this glass so you press it then it's going to show you this thing this let me just erase this thing it's going to show you this box Nyana. then you enter or you paste your your keyword in this thing and then you press search if you're using a pc and then you cannot do this thing or you cannot see that last you can press Control plus f then it's going to work for you né? then the next addition we're looking for the definition i got <coughs> So as you can see, there are numbers one out of two, which means that the results or this name appear in this study guide two times. And then as you can see, here are the arrows which control. So if you want to go up, maybe let's say that you missed something, then you want to go up to it, then you can press this one. If you still want to go down to the last research, then you can press this one of going down. So we can check extra addition then we check the definition. Here's a, here it is. The surrender of an alleged fugitive from justice or criminal by one of by one state to another so we can check let's check the options so it's number one as you can see pa, we have the answer so fast then let's check number two and then we 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 we, we put it there then pa natural what what to give a foreigner the rights and privileges of citizen then we will look for the to give the rights to foreigners 
Number one, give permanent resident rights to what what nope. Number two, give rights to foreign and what what. So you can see that is number two. Pa. Speed. Very fast. So you can like you can see that I answered two questions within sixty seconds. Sixty seconds, but I managed to answer two questions. So let's just find something which is like uh, challenging and stuff like that. Things like X, things like case, cases and stuff like that. So here's an act. Yeah? To give effect or uh, to give effect to citizens' political rights and what what. So let's, I'm not wearing my spectacles. I cannot find my spectacles. So I cannot see that well. So some certain things I'm not going to be sure when I'm pronouncing. Yeah. Which also limit this right to citizens was in enacted so i'm just gonna take this one political right and be like pa and then take it here and then i go to my box and then i put it to my political right pa. this thing appears 11 times as you can see so i have to scroll down so i press this thing going down i focus on the green and yellow part be like okay sharp obvious political what what does not explain anything political what does not explain anything granted political which includes the political party in the what 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 i does not talk what, about what i want until i find something which talks about what i want boom i got it as you can see let me just highlight it so that, so that you can see you see to give effect to citizens political right the electoral act 73 of 1998 which also limit this right and what what so let's go to our options this is structure this is what what so here's our answer pa, very fast so let's check this number 10 okay. section of the constitution restrict the right to a passport only so you'll be like okay 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 let me just check constitution restrict and see what what do i get in my study guide very 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 fast guys very 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 fast if you master this thing you can find uh, an exam within two minutes sure. it appears only once as you can see so yeah all three everyone is entitled to the freedom of what what section 20 section 21 of four of the constitution restrict the passport This thing says state that 23 citizen and then 21 of four citizens are permanent or right. so the question the answer could be number two or number three so this is how i have to be smart on this one we have to be smart we have to be smart that's why i'm i told you guys that you need to read so that you may understand which was what was not so there's permanent there is citizen so in this thing as you can see there's no way they're talking about permanent they're talking about what citizens so which means that number two is the answer guys this one is the answer pa. that's how we do it bro. that's how we slay that's how we slay this thing that's how we do it as you can see the constrict the right to passport only she this here is the question so this is how we do thing like a case yeah how we find a case we found a case we found a case so yeah mm, in, in the sac held that the detention of a refugee was unlawful and impossible where the refugee has applied for asylum what what yeah. so how do i get this one very fast and then i copy go straight to study guide very fast then I put my keyword and then yeah I see three cases Arsa what what I see Bula I see Irasa what what so one thing that I said that guys is it is important for you to read so imagine if you have read this thing so you know good to know man this case is okay sharp you will scan very fast Arsa what what arrest so let me just check the question again it talks about detention of refugee unlawful and what not just have to check between these three cases which case talks about detentions and stuff like that is here it is detention arrest adoption what what traveling document and stuff like that it was held that detention and refugee was unlawful here's that question pa. as you can see so which means that it's arrest what what 
in the minister is the first option pa. and then let's go to the second one the second one states that the entitled to be both released from custody and protected against the deportation order because they indicated a desire to make an application refugee status okay let's just check let's just check those cases please note because of the keyword is the same i will not enter it again i rather scroll down here it is is Bulawayo so this is against the petition status and what what so the name of the case is what Bula and other minister for what so our answer is going to be option number four this, this is very very important it's very 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 simple number 20 yeah longest one this will be challenging at least in the expertise chairperson of the constitutional assembly in recertification of mm, the constitutional court held that there is no universal mode for separation of power and that this is not uh, absolute okay sharp we need to check we need to check we need to check okay see certification of the very fast ah very fast it's more like zimba aguna matanda we are here we are here here is the moon one research so let me just take the options interim constitution of republic constitutional amendment it is number it is number three it is number three constitution of the republic of south africa 1966 uh, 4 sa 747 here it is Constitution of South Africa, what what? Here's the case, expertise a person of what what? So the, the the question might appear straight exactly the way it is in the in the in the study guide. So it is important for you to take a keyword. So a keyword you can take it straight from the from the question or the options we are being. So the moon which is difficult of like that. Yeah. and then the other thing guys because of this thing is um this thing is um okay 49 here's a case i had someone saying that hey cases are difficult and stuff like that cases are so easy 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 easy, easy. let me just take this one as a keyword and see which okay mm. It is not there so which means my keyword okay let me just say that acer track maybe it will allow if a keyword does not work you find another keyword very fast very fast very fast very fast in a come ish thing let me just enter this one very fast this thing is very easy guys you can easily obtain distinction with this method but please make sure that you practice it many times many times many times human dignity ah, there's so many ways there's so many ways to kill a cat there are so many ways to kill a cat so pa, pa, human dignity i told you there are so many ways to kill a cat there are so many ways section 10 yeah the talking about section 10 which case let me just go and check the name of the case is minister of whom my first versus what chenuka something like that yeah here's what uh chenuka what's for chenuka number three here's your case so you can see this thing guys is very easy easy peasy and then if you're using a, lab, a laptop or a pc Here's this thing this thing we call it a split screen is either you press control plus shift plus two then it's going to do it automatically for you ne? control shift plus two ne? it's going to do it so this thing what i like about it is that it can um, 
split two screens because of here we are using a pdf now but in the in the, in a real exam you might find out that we are using uh, the module protocol and don't do any stuff like that so you don't have to go out and going up and down stuff like that no you just split the screen into two, two just like this pa. let's say that he went to paste your study guide here's your study guide and then you decrease you can increase the thing or decrease the thing then even this side you can increase or decrease the size as you can see i have a question paper on this side i have a study guide in this side so you it is up to you it is up to you here you can access your uh your exam module app will be there filming you dividing you and then when you are looking on the screen so there's no way that they can detect uguti you were doing some false stuff and stuff like that because of that thing i don't believe uguti it records whatever that's happening on the screen one thing that i do believe is that it only records you to verify uguti the person who was writing that thing it is you so if you're using this thing by yourself then you're sorted you are covered that's what i can tell you guys so what i can say is that all the best in it and then please do not forget to start don't use this thing and be like ah, i'm not going to start and stuff like that because if you're going to see flames you are going to see flames sometimes it might be difficult for you to get those keywords correctly ne? but make sure that you spend two minutes and what what on every question ne? make sure that you spend two minutes on each question if it is 50 questions for two hours okay and then yeah please make sure that you practice this thing as many times as you can as many times as you can i do believe that whenever you are writing an exam test or assignment you will excel in it so all the best guys whoever has a question can yeah can pop it and then uh, if you have any recommendations please don't hesitate i like recommendations guys